we're the Sing Twins and we're contemporary British artists working in the medium of painting and we work together as a collaboration. The style of painting we work in is based on a very ancient Indian tradition called miniature painting and it's a very decorative, small scale uh, style of work, uh, a lot of detail, a lot of symbolism, a lot of narrative. One of the proposals that were chosen by the city um, to be commissioned for the Capital of Culture was a painting to do with the history of Liverpool itself. The city had its 800th birthday last year in 07, and so the proposal really was to look at that history, uh, represent that within one work, and also um, look at the identity of the city through the traditional coat of arms. Liverpool is traditionally a maritime city, or it has been in its past, and now it's trying to reflect itself as a city of, you know, cap capital of culture. Um, and so the whole idea was to reinterpret the coat of arms um, in that light to show the new identity of the city. We've uh, created a second piece for Capital of Culture which is called um, Arts Matters, The Pool of Life and it's really a reflection of the things that will be happening in Liverpool throughout the year of European uh, Capital of Culture itself. There's a, a tall ship entering the port of Liverpool if you like, um, the Liverpool port being represented on this stage rising from the Mersey and uh, within the ship is the, the new cargo, if you like, which is a change from the old identity of Liverpool with the old you know, cargo during the slave trade of sugar and tobacco and so on and so forth. In the ship today we have representations of um, the cultural life of the city represented through various personalities uh, from you know, the world of television, music, uh, stage, um, co you know, comedy, literature, mm -hmm. so on Famous and so forth. Famous people of Liverpool are connected with Liverpool. Really. Really the first challenge was where do we start because you know how do you get 800 years into one image. Um, usually our, our work is very symbolic so um, very often we have one symbol that tells a whole story within the painting and so the first task really was to read up upon the history number one which, is yeah, which, we, yeah, which we got so involved in it was then oh gosh where do we stop you know it's like doing a PhD thesis. Uh, eventually we had to draw a line and say you know enough time in the research we have to get down and paint this thing so then the process really was sitting down writing a list of the, the things or events that we really wanted to represent. Obviously there were certain things in there like you know, the, the Beatles, for instance, and the slave trade that you could not leave out of the history of Liverpool, they're so well known. Um, but there were other um, things that maybe weren't so well known, like the fact that the first captive gorilla you know, was brought into the Liverpool harbour. So you know, he's represented as King Kong on the Empire State Building in the Liverpool cityscape. So there were little anecdotes like that which we felt would be more interesting to the viewer that didn't have a knowledge of Liverpool history. Thank you.